but I, I do remember as a child this, this flat behind me a bit further back used to have Mitchell grass on it and um, dad had done a little bit of work uh, trying to, to um, slow the erosion on that erosion feature and, and keep the water coming out here but it, that had sort of blown out again and, and all of a sudden yeah we, every 10 years this was getting water uh, but with some work there we've managed to get the water coming back out here even on a small event we don't need that that really big rain we've this has flooded twice uh, in the last six months both times off about 20 mil of rain and and it's you know the, the, this I you'd, you'd only we've had three inches in six months and there's no way in the and all little falls um, normally this country wouldn't look anything like this without having six or seven inches over the summer um, of, of good rain but but it's just it's quite phenomenal what and it's that done. was just from from doing some mitigation work on an erosion feature. Yep, and, and getting it getting it functioning again and getting that water back out where it used to always go but the erosion feature got that deep it was just draining all that water away really quickly and, and unless we had a really big rain event it was never ever getting the opportunity to do what it should have been doing and getting out over all this country. Oh, it, it was quite amazing after the, not long after we did it, we had a couple of really good good events that, that um, filled the wetland right up and, and it overflowed and, and um, walking stock past here a few months later, the, the, the bird life was absolutely amazing. I've never seen anything like it in my, in my life. Um, you'd t pull up and switch your bike off and all you could hear was, was whistle ducks and water hens and it was it was nearly deafening, it was quite amazing. We'd, we'd realised that this, this country wasn't doing what it used to do in terms of, of stocking rates, etc. Um, step one was obviously the exclusion fence, getting control of um, total grazing pressure, uh, but, but we've, we've got to get it all back functioning again. And um, yeah, so I've, I've got a lot better understanding now of of why, why it probably wasn't functioning and working as well as it used to be because all of a sudden areas where water used to flood, it, it doesn't have to be a very big erosion feature and, and that water will just drain out there in no time flat. And, and it's um, often some very little, little works can, can make a massive difference.